Hey guys, it's Roscoe, so let's continue on with part four of Son of Daphne. Back on Coruscant, the Chancellor is on the hollow with uh, Mace Windu saying, um, Count Dooku uh, was seen leading the charge Nord Mantel against a red skinned force wielder. Who could it be? <laughs> it's obviously Darth Maul. Mm. Could this be the rogue Sith you've been looking for? If he is, and he and Dooku are fighting against each other, then perhaps the Republic can use this intel to capture them both, and finally, end the war. Yeah. So, they're having a strategy session, Kenobi, this lady, Commander Wolf gets a mention. It's like all the debris that would identify who was involved is kind of being cleared away. This confirms our intel from the Mandalore Resistance that the alliance between Prime Minister Almec and the Underworld is still intact. Yeah. So they're just looking at star charts trying to figure out what is going on. Well, the Mandalorians have a base here. Blackson has a supply post there. We can't let Mandalore fall into the hands of the Separatists. Master Tipley and I will investigate the outpost and see what comes scurrying out when we shine a light on it. Lord Tyrannus, you disappoint me. So there's the two of them <laughs> captured. There is um, Sidious, there is more. Now you see their failure and yet you could not foresee the trap I laid for them. Your schemes are unravelling, Sidious. Without your generals, your armies will be crushed, as will your plan. That only proves their weakness, not my own. What are your demands? Not my demands, Mother Talzin's. Yes, you remember the mother. She was your ally, but you used her as you used me before throwing us both away, as you will these two. Kill them. I have no more use for either one of them. <laughs> so be it, since new apprentices are apparently so easy to find. <laughs> Tread lightly, Maul. Revenge is a dangerous game, one you never seem to learn. I only lost when I followed you, old man. What do we do with them? Take that monstrosity and put him in the brig. That means, of course, uh, Grievous. Now, as for Dooku... Leave Count Dooku and me alone. We have much to discuss. It would be unfortunate if next time we met Count, I had to add your lightsaber to my collection, Grievous says to Dooku. We all have our parts to play, General. I look forward to our next encounter. So she's saying, I sense your um, turmoil because the last time you came across Morley murdered the Duchess Satine that you liked. And there is uh, Commander Cody <laughs> down at the bottom. I left you... Here to make you an offer, while Grievous is a creature of limited scope, you see much more. You abandoned the Jedi when you understood the Sith were gaining power. Now I suggest you abandon Sidious and serve me. Do you really believe there is any power in the galaxy that can stand against my lord? <laughs> 10,000 Jedi Knights will try this and all will fail. And all will fail. Uh, what hope will your army have? What hope will you have? Mother told Talzin has shown me the real power. She's sold me the truth. <laughs> With our combined strength, we will be his undoing. Our combined strength? When Mother Tals and I last met, she tried to destroy me. That's changing. Count Dooku, forgive our previous disagreements. <laughs> Time to make a deal. You know to betray the Dark Lord is folly. Hmm. So she's just mentioning that uh, when she just came to get more back when he was a child, that it's his son. Her son, rather. When he was no longer useful, Maul was left to die. Sidious will betray you as he betrayed us, but I will honour our alliance should you accept it. Join us. Together we can destroy Sidious and rule the galaxy, or you can choose to die here alone and that is where we shall pause this part and pick it up in the next <laughs>